What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Napisha09, and it's like 1 o'clock in the morning. And I'm up. Why? Hell, I don't know. But, um, I decided to do a video. Just a random ass video. Why is it that the introduction to the video is always the hardest? Like, hi guys, it's Napisha09, and it's like, mm-mm. I don't like that one. The introduction is always so freaking hard to get to get past. But once the introduction rolls, it's like you forget everything that you're gonna talk about. So um really I have nothing to talk about. It's kind of yeah. But um anyway, so as you guys know, I've been trying to lose some weight because like I said I weigh two hundred and one pounds. Well, actually, I'm down 3.4 pounds, so I'm like at 197 now, which I'm happy. But that's neither here nor there. And so, anyway, anyway, I've been going to the gym a lot. I mean, I'm like addicted to the way that it makes me feel. I'm addicted to the sweat. And I don't know. I just can't get enough of the gym. I think, um... I think I may have an addictive personality because I can't seem to quit smoking either. <coughs> <coughs> Don't smoke. But uh, yeah, I go to Bally's Total Fitness and um, they have a whole heap of classes. I mean, they have kickboxing, they have extreme cycling, they have um, stealth dance, they have boot camp. They have silver shoes, silver sneakers for like the old people. And they have um, water aerobics. They have everything that you could possibly want. And so I take advantage of the classes. And there's this one class that comes every Friday. And I'm crushing on the trainer. Oh my God, this guy is beautiful. He's not very tall. He may be 5'7 at the most. But when I tell you when he dances, it makes him look 10 feet tall. Oh, Lord help me. Because baby, ooh, you better believe it. I brought my mama to the gym today and I absolutely thought I was gonna kill her because she was lusting after the same man that I was lusting after. And you know how we are. <laughs> Hey, so have any of you have any of you guys ever heard of have any of you guys ever heard of a green smoothie? Smoothie. 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 Green green smoothie. Green green smoothie. Uh, uh, uh. Anyway, have any of you guys ever heard of the green smoothie? Now what it is is you're mixing greens, like leafy green vegetables with fruit, and you're blending it. And it sounds disgusting. I know. I know it sounds disgusting. But they are surprisingly really, really, really good. Um, my favorite would be the spinach and celery. I mix, I blend my spinach and celery with some bananas, strawberries, peaches. That one is my favorite. But let me tell you, if you are working out, um, especially if you're going to be working out for a, a pretty good time, um, those smoothies are good to replenish your energy and they're supposed to be good as a colon cleanse hey do you know how hard it is to look sexy when you got this they be talking about do belly rolls it's my belly roll hey guys um do y'all know any jokes I, I absolutely love jokes, but I can't seem to remember them after they've been told to me. And I don't really know any jokes. Now, my mom, she knows a whole lot of jokes. But she is the worst joke teller on the planet. And so, her jokes, even though they have the potential to be funny, they're not really. But let me tell you, every time she comes to my house, she looks at my sister and she says, you know. And... It's an inside joke. If you don't know the joke, then you won't understand what she's telling my sister. And so, I'm going to tell you guys the joke. Ready? Okay. 
So this lady, she shops at the same shop every week. She goes to this one shop and she buys things from, from the merchant. And the owner of the store has a parrot that sits upstairs, that sits in front. Oh, excuse me. That sits in front of the store. And as the door opens, he greets the customers. And so every time this lady walks into the store, he tells her, you show is ugly. You show is ugly. So the lady, she thinks nothing of it. She thinks that uh, maybe the parrot's been watching the color purple. And, you know, that's just something that he says. But then she notices other customers are coming into the store. He tells them, hello, hello. So she goes up to the shopkeeper and she tells him, look, your parrot is always calling me ugly and I don't appreciate it. And she was like, you really need to get him to stop or else I'm going to stop coming to your shop. So the man didn't want to lose business because the lady came in like clockwork every single week, every single week. So he walks over to the parrot and he tells the parrot, you have to stop calling this lady ugly. If you say it again, I'm going to put you in the back room. So the lady's thinking to herself, okay, he's talking to a parrot. It's not going to work. So she leaves the store. Then the next week, like clockwork, she comes back. And she's, she, she just knows this parrot is going to call her ugly. But instead, the parrot looks at her. She looks at the parrot. And the parrot says, you know. <laughs>